Hi, this is Bob with Gibbs RV, and today we're looking at a 1996 Southwind Class A motorhome. This is a 36-foot fiberglass body rear tag axle, meaning it has two rear axles. 46,000 miles on this 1996, low miles. You can see uh, it's overall really good condition, but a little bit of fading and checking on your stripes. You can either restripe that or even mask it and shoot some paint on it if you want to look like new again. Predominantly only one side, you see the, where the sun hits it, is where they suffer from the exposure. It's got driver door, it's got an awning topper, tinted glass, big windows and slide out. Look at all these storage compartments that line the slide out. Room to take it all with you. Here in the back, you see this is the drive tires and these are brand new. And then you got the tag axle which helps distribute the weight back here in the rear. This unit does have a generator, and one of the compartments here actually has the uh, control panel. Even a little place to wash your hands back here, access to your water, your tanks, that sort of thing. The back, fiberglass as well with a rear camera, and we also have a uh, trailer receiver back here. Roof rack, ladder, here's the other side. One big window back here in the bedroom area. As far as the uh, the generator goes, I believe it's a yeah 5,000 watt Onan marquee. So dry camping, not a problem wherever you go. You can see down the sides of this coach, no delamination. The only thing, as I mentioned earlier, you've got some checking, mainly in these kind of uh, mob stripes here. Um, there you can see it a little bit clearer, but uh, cosmetic only. Not to be a problem. Side, look at this super clean hardwood floors carpet shows little to nowhere in the front area two captain seats flex steel seats high quality built on a Ford platform 46,000 miles and just look at the visibility here you see you have one little rock chip in the windshield but no cracks no breaks Got overhead storage, TV in the center console. We'll just pan around here. There is a lounger chair as you walk in. Also a flex steel with a fold-up card table right beside and drink holders. Reading light above. They've got some additional cabinets here in the overhead. You can see these are on the spring-loaded hinges too. Carpet ceiling, which is kind of the signature of a luxury coach. And you can see it's domed, rounded. So is the roof. That keeps the water to just rolls off better. Snow doesn't accumulate. Sofa bed uh, for additional sleeping. And here's those big windows we saw from the outside. It's got a booth dinette and it's a big booth. Easy to get into. And when this makes into a bed, of course, you have a large bed there as well. Kitchen is absolutely marvelous. I mean, look at all this counter space. We've got the coffee pot elevated so it doesn't take up any room. The sink is stainless steel, dual basin thick cutting boards for covers. It's even got uh, countertopping over the stove here and uh, a little bit of scratching there on the surface but not too bad. Power exhaust vent over the top, microwave over the sink, double door refrigerator. This too is something you only see in your luxury units but looks like we've got freezer on one side, refrigerator on the other. As we come to the back, um, here's a wardrobe closet I guess you would, you would say or you could probably put a, uh, a washing machine in here as well if you wanted to with sliding glass doors and these are on rollers they just roll really nice and they got locks on either end so they're not going to be sliding around while you transport and here's the other side here in the far back got a queen walk around bed and you can see it's pretty easy to maneuver around this here's these matching windows on either side lots of light in Another television in the back as well. Overhead cabinets, built-in reading lights, speakers built-in, and wardrobe closets on the side. Okay, what do we got in door number three? We'll check it out. Big double, double opening door. And uh, there's our toilet, sink, vanity mirror, triple mirror actually, and power exhaust vent over the top. Shower enclosure is glass, two-piece, Plenty roomy in there as well. So, hate to think what something like this cost new, but it's value priced here at Gibbs RV. Low miles, recently serviced, well maintained, in great shape. It's a 1996 Southwind by Fleetwood. 
right here at Gibbs RV Superstore in Coos Bay. Remember, we take trade-ins. We also offer great financing, and uh, we can even help with delivery if you don't live in the area. So give us a call at 1-800-824-4388. That's Gibbs RV.